The stylish sport of dressage returns to Madrid in Spain for the third leg of the 2021-22 FBI World Cup season. Spain is represented by home fan favourite Juan Matut Guimau with his number one horse Quantico. He already made his return to the series in Lyon after an incredible recovery from a life-threatening brain bleed in May 2020. And now he's delighted to be competing back at his hometown, Madrid. I'm so pleased, so so proud to be able to host you know, in Madrid a World Cup qualifier and to be able to compete once again, you know, because 2019 was our last outing at this show. Last year, of course, was uh, cancelled due to COVID, but uh, here we are again, and even after my brain bleed, even better, better than ever, and uh, I'm very, very pleased. You know, to, to be honest, uh, our goal at this show was just uh, to come out, uh, to do a good, good tests, and to achieve uh, potentially better scores, you know, better results for uh, next year, 2022 uh, World Equestrian Games. That's our target. I always try to achieve uh, the, the best scores possible, and uh, I, I always like to put on a show. And uh, okay, I, I don't know how we will do in terms of results, in terms of uh, the ranking, but I always want to try to achieve a top three placings for sure. It's Juan Matute Gamon and Quantico. Juan is 24 years old. Quantico 15, Hanoverian Gelding. They're competing in the second World Cup qualifier here. They had super results on Leon last month finishing ninth in the Grand Prix and eighth in the freestyle with 76.420. Again, a difficult transition there from the canter half pass into a PF pirouette. And a bit of Bruno Mars to get him going. This music matches this horse so well and really shows off Juan's personality. He really is such a showman. Lovely activity in the passage. Great PF this time, maintaining that level of activity here. Really picking up some great scores. Lots of 7.5s and 8s from the judges. 78.160, 72.4, technical, 83.920, artistic. Such joy, so much excitement. Uh, there, was, there was some magic in the air. And uh, I really thought that we had a good test. Pity the mistake in the first diagonal with the twos and the ones. It was my fault, it was my mistake. I got you know, miscoord discoordinated, uh, but uh, we, we made it up for the second diagonal, so I'm happy. Yeah, and actually, it's, it's most surprising because there was quite a tough field of competitors, you know? And uh, to come back and to do such an amazing results uh, in, in my hometown in Madrid, it's such a, such a privilege. I, I feel very, very proud.